Well, hello again everybody. I'm Gary Cutlack for Tech Digest and probably not shiny shiny because they really don't like these battery videos. Um, and yes, it's another one of those battery videos. Another pound shop battery power test. Um, so, can I just say first of all, if you don't like batteries, don't watch this video. I'm not forcing you. I don't want to see loads of comments saying, oh, another stupid one of those stupid battery videos from that stupid man who likes batteries. I'm sorry, I like batteries, so I'm going to do a video about batteries. And if you don't like it, there's plenty of links up there to stupid clips of fat people falling over and idiots doing karaoke versions of pop songs. So just, just don't watch this video, okay? It's for people who like batteries, people who are interested in batteries and want to learn about the science behind batteries. So if you don't like batteries, stop watching this video now. Right. Now we've got rid of all those idiots who don't like batteries, um, we can get on with today's test. Um, I have acquired these high power, heavy duty AA batteries. Now, high power, heavy duty sounds like quite a boast to me. Sounds like they're going to be quite an impressive set of batteries, judging by the name and the fact that they've even written high power in capital letters. So I'm expecting quite a lot from them. And what I'm going to do, because my battery tests have been quite random and ridiculous and complicated, I'm going to standardise the battery test format from now and going forwards. So I'm going to insert these batteries into my torch. Then I'm going to leave the torch running on my computer while I carry on doing my daily work. And then I'll come back to you every 10 or 15 minutes or so with an update about if the batteries are still working or not. Then that way we'll have a standardised test. We can see how long these last for, whether it's 20 minutes or an hour or two hours or three hours. And then next week when I do another battery power test we'll have we'll have some sort of way of working out which batteries are best overall in the global scheme of things. So I hope that makes sense. So, away we go. Now these, these batteries don't even come in a cardboard backed case which is really quite amazingly cheap of them. So I don't have particularly high hopes but we'll give them a go anyway. Now I'm going to put them in the torch. Again, always Make sure you insert them the right way round. Well, I think that's the right way round. We'll soon find out. Oh, 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 it was already on. I'd left it on. No wonder the previous set was flat. Well, there we go. Yep, it's a good beam. There's no fading. Um, so what I'll do now is I'll leave it running here. No, not that's that's shining in my eyes. That's not very pleasant. Um, uh, I'll leave it. I'll leave it there. Hopefully you can still see that. And what I'll do is I'll leave it five or ten minutes and then come back and we'll see if it's still working. Um, it's now 10 minutes later and it's still working. I should should have said I started the test at 3 p.m. It's now 10 past 3 and uh, no sign of power fade. Uh, it's uh, 25 past 3 and it's still working. So maybe I'll leave it uh, till about quarter to 4 next. Yeah, it's quarter to four now and it's uh, still going. Uh, I might be here for quite some time. I wasn't planning on this video being quite so long and boring. Uh, it's quarter past four now and uh, it might be my imagination but I think the beam's got a little bit fainter. But uh, it's still consistent so I'm going to leave it for another 10-15 minutes. Oh, it's, it's, it's 5.17. I, I took my eye off it. 
It's 5.17. Um, it's, it's finished. Uh, um, it must have gone off about two or three minutes ago and I wasn't paying attention. But anyway, that means, that means they lasted for about two hours and five minutes or two hours and ten minutes. I'll, I'll give them the benefit of the doubt and I'll say two hours and ten minutes. Um, so, battery, battery standardised power test one. Preliminary results. No, final results. High power, heavy duty. Two hours and ten minutes.